Hello everybody, what is up? My name is Neon Infinity and today we are back for the 10th episode of Terraria Modded. <laughs> now today, the world is on fire so we must stop it. So, the reason why this is happening is because in Furnace's wrath, meteors rain from the sky. When approaching hell, Infernus' guardians may attack the player. Defeat Infernus to stop this effect. Okay. And we also found a nice pet. It's not really a pet. It's more like an overseer. Snatcher, the cursed prince. Uh, you don't seem to have a soul. What a shame. Okay, then. Let's make a deal. In your journey, you are defeating endless amounts of enemies. But you are not collecting their souls for yourself, right? Why not give them to me then? For certain amounts, I will give you some kind of reward. Does that sound good enough? I hope so. And we've collected 1,769 souls. <laughs> so we've already got increased movement speed by 25, defense by 10, and damage reduction by 10, which is good. Now, today we need to... Defeat Infernus before we need to go to the Abyss. So, Infernus, Fire Core. There we go. Fire Core. And let's go to Hell. Yay! Ah, oh, we love going to Hell. And we also made the Fire Treads as well. What they do is uh, it's just the desert trailers with a Lava Charm, Hellstone Bars, and five Fire Essence. You get Fire Essence from enemies in hell now because as soon as you beat Skeletron um, you get fire essence basically oh dear What is this? Why is my screen shaking? Oh, I see it now. You see what? A new challenge arises. You have a long way to go. Ooh, Lauren elements awoken, question mark. 
There we did it. We were. Whoa. There we did it. Yes, we did it. But there we go. We beat Infernus. And now the sky is clear once more. Oh, for God's sake. Goblin army. You know what? There's not been one on camera, so we'll quickly do this. Now, I want to show you how OP carnage this sword is that I got from one of the post Skeletron treasure bags actually is. Literally. I, I'm not even wearing melee armor right now, and it's just absolutely tearing through enemies. Look at it go! Look at it! Carnage! It is literally carnage. God diggle dang it. There we go. Goblin army easily cleared just like that. Lol. Well then, that was nice. So, in furnace treasure bag, we got some more fire essence. Uh, take those loot bags as well. So, what do we get? Inferno vortex, magic weapon. Whoa. Okay, that's a bit cool. Wait, is it spiraling inwards? It is. Oh, right. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> Inferno Heart. Ignites nearby enemies, blows up lesser enemies that are on low health, lights up the area. Mm. Mm. So, what is... Oh, what's that? Clothia's Wrath. Ah, yes. I'm shooting the Clothia's Wrath at the Clothia. That's great. Well, today is the day we go to the Abbey Abyss. So, what should we take with us? I know we have diving gear, that. This, Arctic diving gear. Moderately reduces breath loss in the Abyss. I think we need that. Uh, we'll take that over the balloons for now. Okay, Mr. Alchemist NPC. Teleporter potion? Seller? Yes, give me. Beach. Time to go down. Okay, sulfuric po poisoning, please stop now. Okay, thank you. Dread root, light the way. <laughs> And, ooh, Chaotic all got a nice texture upgrade. Let's see, so this Strange Orb provides a small, a large amount, large amount, okay, large amount of light while underwater. It's a little siren. Huh. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I do not know why I'm here, except um, I need specific potions that come out of the pots from this place. Life steal? No, not life steal. Life force. Oh, oh dear. Oh, oh goodness. Oh, viper fish. Okay, toxic minnow. More like dead. Ha 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 ha. Okay, what's this? Anechoic plating. I do believe yes. Re reduces creatures' ability to detect you in the abyss. Reduces the defense reduction the abyss causes. Huh. Uh-oh, Viperfish, don't you do it again. Ooh. What is this? Planty mush. I can grab this. I'm gonna grab it. Oh, that's Tenebris there, I think. That blue stuff. And I can't mine that, which is a bit annoying. Planty mosh, eh? Planty mosh. Planty mosh. Oh, damn. You do a lot of damage. Okay, so I might want to use this sort of lifesteal, actually. Come on, jellyfishes. I need to steal your life. Thank you. Oh, my God. I just dashed into a viper fish on accident. Okay, here we go again. Cuttlefish. Thank you. More eel. More like... 
um, exploded into a bunch of bloody orbs. A uh, burn, no, cuttlefish. I do not want your cut cuttleness. I've come to take your loot, Black Anurian. Oh, hello, dungeon. How's it going? Moray eel, please, why do you do this to me? Just let me just destroy you in peace. Torrential tear, finally, we can turn and turn off rain. Turn and turn off. Hmm. Yes. Now let's just uh, grab some more planty moosh, which I do not have the inventory space for. Come on, planty moosh, get in my belly. This is what I want. This is. This is what I want. Huh? Okay. Next chest. Archer fish. Grab that. Now I need more life force potions because I still only have one. I don't think I'm going to get all 30 of them. I mean all 28 of them. To be honest, I am. I'm, I'm almost sure of it. Because they're probably quite quite rare. Oh no, viper fish! No, 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 no. You do not get to play that lionfish. This is probably one of the best pre-hard mode rogue weapons. It is very good against the wall of flesh, I must say. Plant a mush. Get here, boy. Thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. Two viper fish. Just shoot down, shoot down. Haha. -ha. Taste my stars. I know that nobody comes down here, but I'm the king of the abyss now. This chest, I'll just mine in here like so. Thank you. Thank you for being so hospitable. Uh, Depth's Charm reduces the damage caused by the pressure of the Abyss while out of breath removes the bleed effect caused by the upper layers of the Abyss. Damn, there's so many effects. More plant in mush get in my belly. Because I need a crap ton of crafting materials. Can I not get in there? No, I can't. Okay. Viper fish. Taste my carnage. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. You taste my car. Oh, hello. Aw, oh, fish. You a long boy. You a long boy, aw, oh, fish, aren't you? Yes, you are. You a long boy. You a very long boy, and you don't attack me, but I'm still going to kill you. Thank you. Right. Still nothing. Oh, laser fish. Oh, goodness me. Hello. Were you born from the golem or something? No. <laughs> God dang it, man. That's annoying. Oh, well. We did good. We got some stuffs. We got a crap ton of planty mush. Planty mush indeed. So only one life force potion. That's annoying, but oh, well. Anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you did, smack that like a button and the subscribe. <laughs> Why do I always do it in that accent? It's really weird. Uh, we need depth cells and luminal for that, so that's far from being made. And yes, uh, what was I going to say? Don't forget to uh, subscribe. My, uh, I built this. <laughs> and like. Yes. Do it right now if you haven't, or uh, you're gonna get 10 years of bad luck. Yes, I have the authorities to say that now. Mm-hmm. Yep. Now you know who you're messing with, boy. <laughs> okay, and yes, I will see you all in the next video. Stay inside, stay safe, and wash them hands. And yeah. Bye, and stay awesome, guys.